Mark Cavanis here for an Alfred Sacred Jubilate Music digital reading session, and with me in the studio today via Skype, Benjamin Harlan. Hey, Benji. Hey, Mark, and welcome to New Orleans via Skype on a beautiful day. That's right. That's right, Benji. Listen, you're our first Skype uh, person with our digital reading session, so it's great to have you here, Benji, with us in our studio for this digital reading session. And you know what we're going to talk about today, Benji? We're going to talk about Hymn Fest this wonderful new collection that you have put together for Alfred Jubilate. And uh, Benji, you know, uh, when we were talking, you and I go way back, Benji, and uh, you're one of my favorite people in the world. You really are. And you're always a, a lot of fun. I wish before we were uh, started rolling the camera here, uh, Benji had all kinds of fun things we were talking about and doing. We'll save that for the outtake reel. But Benji, you are... Uh, when I was thinking that I would like to do a, a collection of hymns, you are really the expert in congregational hymn singing. So let's talk just a bit about Hymn Fest and what, uh, what drew you to put the hymns in this that you did, and, and any other thoughts you have about the experience of putting together collection in general. Mark, when we decided to do Hymn Fest, what we wanted to do was celebrate the Christian community coming together and singing, something that's been an important part of the Christian church for a couple of thousand years. We picked hymns that you and I discussed, things that had timeless significance, things like all creatures of our God and King, joyful, joyful, we adore thee, for the beauty of the earth, this is my Father's world. We tried the collection out for the first time at a premiere at First Baptist Church in Jackson, Mississippi. And as I suspected, they really did touch people in a very deep part of their hearts and souls. Absolutely. It's a beautiful uh, service, and we're going to be watching excerpts from that service very soon. The thing I'm really excited about this collection, Benji, is that it's so flexible. Um, you know, it can be the, the five anthems that are in the collection can be sung separately, or you can put the five anthems together, and there's some simple narration that hooks them together if you want to do them together, and that would last for about 20 minutes within the context of a larger service. So, and, and yet, the, uh, yet a third option on how to present it, we have free downloadable service suggestions to create a whole hour-long uh, service with additional anthem suggestions, additional hymn suggestions, so that you can take this collection, Hymn Fest, and use it as the centerpiece to a complete hour-long service. If you want to have a whole singing service of hymns and just singing, could do that on a Sunday night, a Sunday morning, whatever. So the collection, as I say, very flexible as separate anthems or as a 20-minute kind of mini hymn fest or with the free downloads, a complete hour-long service. So very flexible, isn't it, Benji? And uh, and certainly something that I think is very useful. And uh, as as we say, the uh, the premiere at uh, First Baptist Jackson, Mississippi, an incredible time. And so we're going to go there now, Benji. Any final words you want to say about the presentation that night, and then we'll see uh, see everyone on the other end of this. Mark, three things quickly. First of all, all kinds of possibilities for voicings all kinds of possibilities for various age groups to make it a multi-generational experience, and also a rich, rich fabric in the accompaniment underpinnings that will help the hymns leap off the printed page. Absolutely. Well said, Benji. So let's listen now to excerpts from HymnFest.
So those were excerpts from Hymn Fest, the five-song hymn collection arranged by Benjamin Harlan and premiered at First Baptist, Jackson, Mississippi. And even though you saw that very large choir performing it, certainly these uh, anthems and arrangements are equally as effective with 20 voices. Wouldn't, wouldn't you agree with that, Benji? Absolutely, Mark. We want it to be usable by choirs of any size. And I would also say that in closing, when you look at these songs, which are timeless in nature, we don't look at it as some old songs. We look at it as fellow believers and disciples holding hands over the centuries and singing together. So enjoy and let everyone sing with every breath. Absolutely, Benji. Thank you so much. This was great, Benji. It's good to see you on Skype. And uh, really appreciate your time here today. And uh, we're excited about HymnFest. Thank you for your work on it, Benji. Mark, thanks so much. Absolutely. And thank you for listening to this Alfred Sacred Jubilate Music digital reading session.